Hello everyone and welcome to day two of your Move With Me series. Today I have a really fun bar cardio class for you. Now if you haven't done one of the bar cardio classes before, how it works is that we will have two rounds. In each round there will be five different exercises that will target different muscle groups of the body. And then the fun part is, is that in between those five exercises we will have short cardio bursts to really get your heart rate up. But without further ado, let's get straight into it with a warm up. So come to your chair or if you have any steady surface that you can lean on, like a kitchen counter or anything like that, get to that and then walk your feet back coming into a fold over position. On your exhale, round your spine and gaze towards your navel. Inhale, arch your spine and look slightly up. And again, exhale as you round. Inhale as you arch. Let's do two more. Really warming up our spine, pairing our breath with our movement. Last one. Then come to your neutral spine, really lifting up through your navel. On your inhale, straighten your right leg, reach your right arm up to the ceiling. Then exhale, twist, straightening your left leg, bending your right knee. And again, inhale as you open, exhale as you twist. Alternating, bending one knee and then straightening the other. Let's do one more. Beautiful. Let's switch sides. So inhale, straighten your left leg, reach your left arm up. Exhale, twist, bending the opposite leg. And again, inhale and exhale. Two more. Last one. Good job. Let's release our hands now down to the mat, keeping a soft bend through your knees. Just hang over your legs here, holding on to opposite elbow with opposite hand. Just letting your body relax, maybe swing side to side, releasing any tension through your lower back. Then release your hands down to the mat and very carefully Roll your spine vertebra by vertebra up to standing. Let's come to the center of our mat now. Take your feet out nice and wide in a parallel position. Reach your arms out in line with your shoulders and we're just going to take some isolations through our rib cage. So reaching side to side. Really think of still drawing your navel in, keeping your nice straight posture, just reaching side to side. Let's do four more. Three, two, and one. Now stretch that right arm over, coming into a nice side bend, taking your gaze up towards the ceiling. Then turn your chest down towards the mat, coming into a nice flat back stretch, really lengthening through the crown of your head. And then forward fold over your left leg. Come through center, bend your knees and carefully roll your spine back up. Reach your arms out to the side and let's repeat. We just stretch and stretch side to side maybe reaching a little bit further this time really warming up through the sides of our waist here let's do four more three two and one stretch your left arm up and over now coming into your side bend 
taking your gaze up if that feels good for you. Then turn your chest to the floor, coming into that flat back. Really reach through your fingertips, reach through the crown of your head. And then fold over your right leg. Beautiful, come back through center, keeping your feet in a parallel. Let's just bend our knees, coming into a squat and then forward fold. So inhale as you squat, exhale as you fold, warming up our legs here. Let's do three more. And two, sitting those hips nice and low. Last one. Good job. Bend your knees and carefully roll yourself up to standing. Turn your feet out, making sure your feet are nice and wide. And let's finish our warm up with some plies. So we just plie down and up. Nice inhale and exhale. Just eight more. And seven, keeping your spine nice and straight five four three two and one hold low little pulses down and down just eight more seven nice relaxed shoulders five four three two and one good job hopefully you are feeling a nice and warm so shake it out if you need to grab a sip of water and then let's come to round one of our bar cardio class and come to our first exercise so for our first exercise come to your chair or your table and bring your heels together with your toes apart Really draw your navel in, drop your tailbone, standing up nice and tall, and bend your knees. Let's start by extending our right leg forward, making sure that right leg is turned out and you're pointing your toes. Reach your right arm up towards the ceiling, and on your exhale, let's lift our leg and lower. Nice, exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Just six more. Bringing your arm down to meet your leg at the same time. Four. And three. Two. And one. Let's hold the leg lifted. Then if you can, lift your left heel, bend into your left knee and we pulse down. Four, eight, seven. Really reach through those toes. And five, four, three two and one well done other side let's extend our left leg out make sure it's turned out reach your arm up and exhale lift inhale lower exhale lift inhale lower just six more and five now it's not important how high you lift your leg, it's more important that you're keeping that turn out, keeping your spine nice and straight. Let's do two more. Last one, hold your leg lifted, lift your right heel high, bend your knee and pulse it out. Four, eight, seven, six, you've got it. Five, four, three, two, and one well done first cardio burst let's come into a squat position with your toes turned out draw your navel in arms start in front we squat down then kick one leg out to the side so you squat and kick squat and kick nice inhale and exhale really using those arms creating lots of energy and heat through our body here. Let's just do 10 more seconds. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. That's cardio one, done. Okay, second exercise. 
come back to your chair and then I want you to walk your feet back about halfway. Now from here, make sure that your spine is nice and straight. You're drawing up through your navel and you've got a soft bend through your knees. Let's flex our right foot and then press your right leg up towards the ceiling, trying to get your thigh parallel to the floor. Recheck your posture, so draw your navel in and let's lower the leg and press back. Inhale, lower, exhale, press. Really trying to press your right heel up towards the ceiling. Just four more. Really breathe. Inhale and exhale. Two more. Last one. Now hold the press, little pulses up. Four, eight and seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, point your toes, extend your leg back, little challenge. Let's pull our knee in towards our chest on our exhale, then inhale, shoot the leg back. So you exhale, pull up, inhale, hinge forward, just six more. You should really feel your left glute here. Four more. Standing up nice and tall as you pull that knee in towards your chest. I think that's only two more. And last one. Now hold that leg back, really bend into your left knee. Take little pulses up for eight and seven, six. Then we have our cardio burst, four, three, two, and one. So good, straight into your cardio burst. You squat and lift, squat and lift. When you lift that leg out to the side, you should really feel your left glute. It's a good thing, it just means that it's working. Really breathe, nice inhale and exhale. Sitting those hips back nice and low. Make sure that your knees are pressing out as you come into your squat. Just 10 more seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. For our next exercise, let's come down to the mat for this one, giving our legs a little bit of a break. Roll down onto your back, resting your head, and then imprint your spine and lift your legs to a tabletop position. Make sure your knees are stacked over your hips and just cross one ankle over the other. Let's take eight hip lifts. So on your exhale, lift your hips off the floor. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Inhale, lower. Trying not to swing your legs here. I want you to use the strength of your lower abs to lift your legs up. Three more. And two. Last one. Well done. Hands behind your head, elbows wide. Let's curl up. Exhale, curl. Inhale, lower. Exhale, curl. Inhale, lower. Six more. And five, four, maybe curling up a little higher, three, two, and one. Now from here, a little combo. Open your knees a little bit more, but keep your ankles crossed. On your inhale, lower your head, shoot your legs out, and then switch the crossing of your legs and exhale, pull everything back in. So inhale, extend, lower your head, switch the legs, exhale, pull in, keep going. Inhale, switch, exhale, curl. Four more. Making sure that your lower back stays in contact with the floor here. Really working those abdominals. Just 
two more. This is your last one. Well done. Let's extend those legs out again. Find a little change. Crisscross your legs. Let's go for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Quickly hop one up, get straight into your cardio burst. We squat and lift, squat and lift. We only have two more exercises after this. So you are more than halfway through your first round. Keep using your arms here, really reaching those arms out to the side. 10 more seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Okay, for our fourth exercise, let's come to the center of our mat in a nice wide second position. Reach your arms out by your side and let's start by flipping our palms up towards the ceiling. We're gonna plie down and up as we flip the palms back and up. Nice inhale and exhale, inhale and exhale. Just four more and three. Two, last one. Let's hold in our plie and take little circles for eight, seven, palms facing back, five, four, three, two, and one. You guessed it, reverse it for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Back to our plies. We press and down, nice, exhale, and inhale. Just six more, and five, four, you can do it. Three, two, last one, hold low, palms back, finish with little lifts up for eight, and seven, maybe bend into your knees a little bit more, four more, three, two, and one. Well done. Guess what? Second last cardio burst. We squat down and lift. Squat and lift. Make sure that you're keeping your nice straight spine. So keep lifting up through your belly button. You've got it. Just 10 more seconds. Nine. You should really feel those muscles in your arms working. Five four, three, two, and one. Well done. Okay, final exercise. Let's come back to our chair and let's step our right foot back in our lunge position. Really draw your navel in, drop your tailbone. We lunge down and up. Nice, inhale and exhale. Making sure that your left knee is stacked over your left ankle. Four more. And three, keeping your spine super straight. Last one, hold low in your lunge. Really drop your tailbone. Let's lift our left heel up and down. Nice, inhale and exhale. Just six more. You should feel a nice burn through the front of your right quad, keep going. Shoulders nice and relaxed. Last one. Now hold that heel down. Let's push ourselves forward, kicking the back leg up, and then return to your lunge. Exhale, push, inhale, lunge. Four, six, keeping your spine straight. Five, four, Three, you've got it. Two, last one, hold in your lunge, reach your arms forward, little pulses down for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, 
and a one. Guess what? Final cardio burst for round one. Let's go. You inhale and exhale. Squat and kick. Really point through those toes. Stretch through your legs. Round one is almost over. Let's do 10 more seconds here. Let's go. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, guys. Round one is done. Have a sip of water if you need to. Shake out whatever you need to shake out and get ready for round two. Okay, getting ready for round two. Let's return to our first exercise. So bring your heels together, your toes turned out and bend your knees. Extend your right leg forward, reach your right arm up. We lift the leg up and down nice exhale and inhale just six more remember it's not about the height of the leg we're really trying to think of engaging our leg muscles turning the leg out and really reaching through your toes last one hold your leg lifted lift your left heel high bend your knee and pulse it out four eight seven Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Other side, extend your left leg out, reach your arm up. We exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Six more. Standing up nice and tall. And four, three, two, last one, hold your leg lifted, lift your right heel high, bend your knee, pulse it out, four, eight, seven, really reach through that left leg, five, four, three, two, and one, well done. Cardio burst for round two. We're gonna start standing. We take our hands to the mat, walk our hands forward, come into a plank, Walk your hands quickly back, roll up to standing and take two knees to chest. Let's go. Hands come down, walk them out, walk them back, roll up, two knees to chest. Now make sure that as you walk your hands out and walk them back, that you're trying to keep your hips as still as you can. So you're really using the strength of your core to keep your body nice and stable. You've got it guys. Moving at your own pace. Let's do 10 more seconds. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Okay, second exercise. Come back to your chair. Walk your feet back about halfway bend your knees and this time let's flex our left foot and draw your left heel in towards your glute make sure your right leg is nice and bent you're drawing up through your navel exhale press the leg back inhale lower exhale press inhale lower just six more making sure that you're not arching through your spine as you press that leg back so keep thinking of dropping your ribs down to your hips as you press the leg back. Two more. Last one. Hold the leg back, little pulses. Up and up. Just six more. Five, four, three, two, and one. Point your toe, extend your leg back. We press up to standing, pull your knee into your chest and then extend it back, really bending into that right knee. Let's go, exhale, you lift, inhale, extend back. Six more, really working your right glute here. Bit of a balance challenge. 
You've got it. Just three more. And two. Really point through your toes as you extend back. Last one. Now hold that leg back. Make sure your hips are parallel. Take little pulses up. Four, eight, seven, six, five. Really bend into your right leg. Three, two, and one. Well done. Cardio burst. Let's go. Hands to the mat. Walk out to a plank. Walk back and take two knees to your chest. Moving at your own pace here, but always keeping that control in your movements. Keeping your core engaged. Make sure that you're breathing. Let's do 10 more seconds. 10, nine, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good job. Let's come down to our mat now for a nice little break for our legs, not our abs. So rest your head, lift your legs to that tabletop position, cross one ankle over the other. We lift our hips up and down. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. Just six more and five, four, enjoying this time on your back, two, and last one. Take your hands behind your head now, elbows wide, exhale, curl up, inhale, lower, exhale, curl, inhale, lower, making sure your lower back is pressing down into the mat, protecting your spine. We have three more. And two. Last one, hold your curl. Open your knees slightly. On your inhale, shoot your legs out. Switch the legs. Exhale, pull everything in. Inhale, extend and switch. Exhale, pull in. You've got it. Six more. Four more. Maybe extending your legs out a little bit lower if you want that extra challenge. Two more. Last one. Well done. Shoot your legs out. Finish with those crosses. Four, eight, seven, six. You can reach your arms forward if you want. Four, three, two, and a one. Roll on up. Straight into a cardio burst. Let's go. Hands come down. Walk out to a plank. Walk back. Come up to standing and take those two knees. Keep going. Keeping the pace up, keeping your heart rate up. You've got it, guys. We are more than halfway through our second round, which is our final round. Really pull those knees nice and high in towards your chest. 10 more seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, Four, three, two, and one. Good job, guys. Okay, let's return to our wide second plie. Reach those arms out by your side with your palms facing up. We plie down and up. Nice, inhale and exhale. Six more. Flipping your palms back and up. Four, three, Two, and one, hold low, little circles. For eight, seven, try to stay low in your legs. Four, three, two, one, reverse it. For eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Back to our plies, up and down. 
Nice, exhale and inhale. Six more. Keep your spine nice and straight. Four, three, two, and one. Hold low, lift your arms up. Four, eight, seven. Bend into your knees a little bit more. Four more, three, two, and one. Second last cardio burst. Let's go. Walk your hands out, walk them back. Come up to standing, take those two knees. Maybe moving a little bit faster this time. Or maybe you need to reserve your energy and take it a little bit slower as you prepare for our last exercise and our last cardio burst. Just make sure that you are still breathing, keeping those energy levels up. 10 more seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, final exercise, how exciting. Let's step our left foot back in our lunge, draw your navel in, drop your tailbone. We lunge down and up, nice, inhale, and exhale, slowing things down a little bit, coming back to our breath. Just four more, three, two, and one, hold low, lift your right heel up and down, lift and lower. I really want you to control the lower of your heel as best you can. Finding that nice little shake in your leg. Two more. Last one. Hold the heel down. Let's push forward. Kick your left leg back. Return to your lunge. Exhale, push. Inhale, lunge. For six. Make sure your hips stay square to the floor. Four. Three. Two, last one, hold in your lunge, reach your arms up, nice straight spine. We finish with pulses down and down. Four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, final cardio burst, let's go. This is your final push of class. Oops, I forgot the knees. <laughs> I got so excited. But this is your final push of class. So I really want you to keep your energy levels up. Keep breathing. Keep your focus. You've done so well throughout the whole entire class. So don't stop now. You've got it. Moving at your own pace. The finish line is almost here. Just a little bit longer. Okay, final countdown. Let's do 10 more seconds. And nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and a one. Well done, guys. Your bar cardio workout is done. Have a quick sip of water if you need to, and then come back and join me for a little stretch. Okay, once you've had a quick sip of water and caught your breath a little bit, let's come back to our chair and just pull your right heel in towards your glute. Really try to send that right knee back, but keep your spine nice and straight. Feeling a nice stretch through the front of your right thigh. Then let's flex our right foot and cross our right foot over our left thigh and sit back into a chair. Feeling a really nice stretch for our right glute. 
We did a lot of glute work today, so this should feel really nice. Then take a big step back with your right foot, coming into a lunge, really open your chest and tuck your pelvis under to feel a stretch for that right hip flexor. Then let's press our hips back, straighten your front leg, flex your front foot, really sending your right heel down towards the mat keeping your spine nice and straight. Then come back up and let's switch legs. So draw your left heel in towards your glute, send your left knee back, keeping your spine straight, releasing any tension to the front of your left thigh. Then flex your left foot, cross it over your right thigh and sit back into a chair. Just breathing into this well-deserved stretch. Then take a big step back with your left leg, finding your lunge, really lift through your chest, tuck your hips under till you feel that stretch for your left hip flexor. Then press back, straighten your right leg, flex your right foot, slightly hinging forward so you feel a release through the back of your right leg. Then from here, let's walk both feet back now, coming into a fold over position, soft bend through your knees. Exhale, round your spine, gaze towards your navel. Then inhale, arch your spine, look slightly up. And again, exhale as you round. And inhale as you arch. Let's do one more, just because this feels so good. Beautiful. Carefully release your hands down to the mat, keeping a soft bend through your knees. And then on your inhale, straighten your right leg, reach your right arm up. Exhale, release down. Other side, inhale, reach your left arm up, straighten your left leg. Exhale, release back down. One more on each side. Breathing into this beautiful twist. Then just hang over your legs for a moment and very carefully, vertebra by vertebra, Roll your spine up to standing. Let's finish class with one last big inhale. Reach your arms up to the ceiling. And exhale, lower your hands down to prayer. Thank you so much, everyone. I hope you enjoyed this bar cardio class and I hope you have the most beautiful day ahead. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow for day three.